I'm Lisa Witherite Reg. I am an osteopathic family physician. Penn Highlands is proud to announce that we received the approval from the American Osteopathic Association this past fall um, to start a family medicine residency program. What that means is we will have the opportunity to help young people who have graduated from schools of osteopathic medicine uh, continue their education and become uh, qualified family medicine specialists or family practitioners. We were approved for 18 slots. What that means is we'll have six first year residents and then in two years, six first year and six second year residents. And eventually by the year 2019, we'll have uh, capacity to have 18 residents for uh, the three years of their program. We are starting with uh, family medicine residents. Hopefully we'll expand that to uh, other specialties, but we're concentrating on what we need here the most. We have cardiology, pulmonology, radiology, nephrology, all the different specialties we have here. Um, very little will residents have to go on what we call out rotations for, and certainly leaving where you're living to go study somewhere for a month is a burden. So we have very, very limited out rotations necessary from this program. Our program does offer very competitive salary, especially for this region. It's a low cost of living. Um, the paychecks are going to be very, very competitive. Um, vacation time off, uh, continuing medical education time off, uh, a consideration for um, what we call a personal development stipend. Um, we're going to give you money to pursue some of your outside interests related to your education. If you want to go to a conference, you're going to have the means to do that, and we'll encourage you to do that. But I think the most um, promising thing about this program is the residents are going to get the opportunity to work one-on-one -on -one with the attending physicians. They're not going to be three, four, five individuals deep um, clawing at trying to get the experiences, the opportunities to see patients or do procedures. The other wonderful thing that we have going for us right now is we are what's called an unopposed residency. That means we're all family medicine residents, not internal medicine residents, surgical residents, um, cardiology residents, kind of clawing to get those experience. All of our energies are being focused and concentrated on educating family doctors. We are offering a half-day didactic program, meaning you don't have to run from here to there to get all of your um, lectures and time in. We are gonna concentrate that in a half day a week. Um, doing that ensures that everybody will be able to be together for those conferences. The availability of live attending physicians to actually lecture uh, goes up and um, the need to reschedule things and, and shuffle schedules around, which is very burdensome, especially in the healthcare field, uh, will be limited. The key to family medicine residency is what we call the continuity of care clinic. That's where you learn the nuts and bolts and actually develop your own um, patient load and patient um, profile. And that will be um, handled through the same office where I work, the Brookville Rural Health Clinic. I'm in Brookville, Pennsylvania, about 20 minutes from the main hospital here. Um, rotations on internal medicine, surgery, orthopedics, urology, um, sports medicine, all of the, the various um, rotations will actually be in the Penn Highlands facilities. Penn Highlands has four hospitals in its um, grouping. Most of the training will be at Penn Highlands Dubois but we will have the opportunity for residents to go to Penn Highlands Brookville, Clearfield, and Penn Highlands um, Elk in St. Mary's. I have lived in Western Pennsylvania since I was six years old. And some of the most wonderful things about our area are the four seasons. Um, we truly have spring, summer, winter, and fall, and you can see the transition of the season in the trees, uh, in the brooks, in the streams, uh, and just watching that out your window or watching it as you're driving down the road is absolutely fabulous. If you enjoy any sports at all, 
football, go Steelers. Um, hockey, yay Penguins. Um, should be rocking the black and gold. Um, baseball, um, huge um, hunting and fishing. Uh, any outdoor sports you would ever want to pursue. Um, all located right here. We are located very strategically to a couple fairly sized cities. Um, it takes me from my home just outside of Brookville an hour and 20 minutes to get to Pittsburgh. So if I would like to go to a major sporting event, a concert, uh, or a play, no problem getting there. The public schools are very good. The music programs are phenomenal in this area for our young people. The crime rate is low. Um, everything you need is within a, a quick 20 minute drive. So easy living. I love what I do. I love being a doctor, but I know I'm not going to be able to do it forever. I'm, like I said, pushing 25 years of doing this, and I want to leave a mark, and I want to make an impact. My biggest impact is going to be providing for my family, my brothers, my sisters, my nieces, my nephews, my husband, son, and my grandchild, knowing that they're going to have good medical care. Um, because they're going to have very well-trained physicians here to care for them for the next generation.